Well, I kind of started already, and once again, wife comes to say they to make sure that I'm documenting everything. So, what what's going on? If she can point over here, here's the tank, <clears throat> and we need to move the tank into position where Mr. Robinson, aka Baby Rico, aka, is, aka, I don't know. So <laughs> the tank needs to go here. Well, tank had to stay there because we had to put on the overflow box. I don't think you guys seen that yet. So let's, the wife is so used to standing in one place. Let's see if we can get her to give us a shot without showing everything else, but shot of the overflow box. So can you go up high and like kinda work it all over? So the overflow box is like 41 inches long. Basically it's a coast to coast. Okay, tank's 48, it's 41 by six and a half deep by I think a foot tall or something. So yeah, that's the overflow box. Anyway, so we need to move it. So we ended up with trying these out. So it says load uh, a thousand pounds. Well, we got 12 feet. We got 12 of these. So Mr. Uh, Baby Rico has been here screwing them on. So I'm trying to get the these pads on. We got a couple on. Yeah, we got a couple on, but, uh, yeah, so yeah. we'll get it moved. You got red eyes. What's wrong with her? <laughs> That's your mama. She's cuckoo? Yeah, something wrong with her. She's the cuckoo bird. She's the cuckoo bird. I'm going to get around outside waking up everybody. <laughs> <laughs> anyway... <laughs> All righty. We are, so, there we go. We got, so, these don't work. I'm actually taking them back. But anyway, yeah, I don't know gonna, where she's aiming that thing at because it's just light in my eye. I'm looking at the table. Our chips and dip. No, why are you looking at the table? People don't want to see the thing chips and dip. And <laughs> what you're doing. Well, you got to get these, this little teeny hole and get this thing to get in there. And it's not easy. It really is. Let's see you do it. Well, you, okay, rule number one. You must have a third hand. I don't have a third hand. Yes, I do. I have my favorite thing that took me many years to get. Guess what? My stomach. <laughs> so, you got to utilize what the good man upstairs blessed you with. You get old enough to get a, a nice little belly in the front for your woman to be your, you know, be her teddy bear, you're okay. So, Gavin, would you like to demonstrate putting it on, on, uh, put one on that foot there since it's already loose behind you? Thank you. To demonstrate how we are going to install putting on these things to be able to move a lot of weight. So they slide right underneath there, right? Yeah. So what are you doing now? What are you doing now? Screwing it down really tight. Okay, why do we need it really tight? So it don't slide around the tape. There you go. See? Alrighty. So keep get it down tight to that and then you'll be able to do it. Now you gotta keep tightening it down just the foot parts before you do that trick, I think, Gavin. You gotta move the foot. Or is the foot moving with it when you're turning it? Yes. Oh, okay. Alright. I'll be quiet. <laughs> I'll let you uh keep doing that before you get me. So Looks like there's stuff all over. Is that just like, uh, oh, like dust. fuzzy stuff? That's, that's just dust from cutting pipe. Yeah, that's just plastic. 
All right. Dust. You think it's tight or do we got it tight? Because we need a tight. It's tight. It's tight? Yes. You, you did your push ups? Yes. Or not tonight? Not tonight. You haven't did your push ups? You know, you got to do your push ups every night before you go to bed, right? You got to get those together. This, this, this ain't nothing unless you get those forearms together. Mm-mm-mm. Okay, so. Am I going to have to get inside of the table? Yeah, no, you're going to go on the other side. Go on the other side and try to undo that foot over there. So, guys, basically, we're going to attempt it. So, we're not going to drag this video out too long. Um, you see what uh, Mr. Uh, Baby Rico, a.k.a. Gavin, is doing. And you mm -hmm. see what I'm doing. So, we're going to pause this here for right now. And when we get ready to attempt to push it, we're going to see how easy it is to push heavy objects on, what are these called? Um, basically furniture mover pads. So we'll see how that goes. So let us finish getting these on and we'll be right back. We're going to get this in place. And... As you can see, our pads that are supposed to make it slide easier on it is garbage. <laughs> so I'm gonna push, I'm gonna hurt myself some more. I'm not going in the, for the front. I'm just gonna use my, my back so it gives pressure flat, which I'm fine, and 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 use my legs and, and my back just to put pressure into the tank instead of me lifting, I'm not lifting. I'm going to be pushing this tank over into its place like right now. So let's get her done. Okay. Yeah, it sure don't feel good for our back. I mean, it, 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 it's not hurting in that way. That's a good thing. But, I'm able to move this tank. Yeah. Slowly but surely, the pads, which we call it, are falling off. Yeah, I don't really get why the put those on. When we were at the store looking at them, I was thinking that the regular pad would work. I mean, the one without the pad that said for carpet. So, uh, I'm going to line this up and get it where I need to get it. And, uh, that's just that. I, I screw these legs back up. I need to come. I need to be right here where this dot is. This is where the insert um, I put for the overflow box. So, we're going to be cutting, I'm going to cut this out. I'm just going to line it, straighten it up with this, get it all straight. That's what we're going to do. Um, and then I'm going to leave it out so I can cut tomorrow with a sawzall and cut it out and probably frame it in so I know. Can you let me know when I'm kind of on that line over there? Oh, I think you might have passed it. Huh? I think you passed it. Don't tell me I passed it. I can't afford to pass it. No, you're fine. Or wait. Mm -hmm. It's kind of actually, but... <sighs> you gotta have your weight up on these kind of moves. Mm -hmm. You can't be built like a pretzel. No, he passed it. Watch out, bit. Gavin. I look straight. I don't know if it's straight. Move. Okay. It looks like it, according to the floor. Yeah, that looks. Well, I'll know more tomorrow. I'll make that cut. Um, I'll put in what I need to make this, make that box. You know, cut in here, and and that's gonna go inside. So, wait, what? Yeah, 
Looks good. So, guys, uh, can you hand me all those little brown pad thingies? Anyway, these are okay. I'm not, I, they, they got the job done to a certain extent, but to pay the money for these pads that do not stay on, this is a clean floor. Um, they're, I'm taking them back. They, they're not doing what I need them to do. I could have bought just the cheap plastic ones to get the same results. Um, so that's just my intake on these. They're going back. Um, period. They would stay. I would keep them for further, uh, for further if I have to move it for whatever reason. God forbid I would ever have to do that. But uh, I would keep them. But because they're not doing what they need to do, I could just get the cheaper ones and be done with it. So, anyway, this is where it's at. So, I will be keeping you guys up to date with when I cut the hole out in the wall for the tank and putting it in position. I'll keep you guys posted with that. So, with that being said, guys, hopefully you guys appreciate what I'm doing. It's not been easy. Very stressful at times. Not not cool when I'm hurting, but guess what? I said what I said. I mean what I say, and I'm going to do what I said, which was lots of content, no matter what. Um, I, I hope you guys are enjoying just this content. We're, I'm knocking it out as best I can. We still haven't hit no 500 likes. My wife said she wanted 500 likes. We still not hit that on any video yet. So uh, let's let's work on that, guys. Um, I'm working, I'm doing my part, you know, I appreciate all the love and support, but, uh, you know, let, let's, let's hit those thumbs up, you know, let's, let's, uh, let's make that happen, and uh, with that being said, I'm starting to say a lot of ums and da da da, uh, I'm tired, so, hurting, frustrated, but, we'll get this done, and we'll show the process when I cut, to, I, I'll probably be cutting this tomorrow, actually I'll be cutting it, so maybe I'll add it to this video or maybe I'll just put it on a separate video and we'll go from there. So with that being said, guys, this is Rico at Rico's Aquariums. Till next time, peace.